I'm Luke. I'm Head of Client Services. I give Envision App three stars. For more reviews, click below. Before Envision App, um, we just presented on laptops and we, we didn't really have a, a way to present remotely. Um, and that was really difficult because um, what Envision App allows you to do is not just present static screens, but also knit those screens together as if they're a real functioning website, for example, so like a mini prototype. So before Envision App, we really didn't have a way to achieve that and Envision App solved that problem for us. We chose Envision App because uh, we needed a way to present to our clients the creative work that we've done. Most of it was digital and we wanted to present it long before any code was written. So we create a lot of websites, we needed a way to show clients what those websites might look like, even allow them to click through and, and uh, apps like they were real websites long before we'd actually built them so that we could get early feedback. And Envision App allowed us to do that. Also allowed our developers to see um, some of the code that was sat behind the designs that we'd done so that they could start to draw from those designs and start to build the real thing. Um, but it also allowed us to do some really early like user testing as well, so we could get end users to come and they could try it remotely and they could give their feedback through the mobile app. Um, and we found that a really useful way to get sure in our minds that we were about to build the right thing before we wasted any money actually building it. Getting started with Envision App was really simple. You only really need to drag your files into a new project and that's it, you can reorder them into whatever order you like. If you want to mimic someone clicking on one part of a page and moving onto a new page or pretend that you're opening a new window or, or a modal window, all, all of that is very just touch of a button. So we found it really easy to get started. We also used a design package called Sketch at the time and uh, we could export directly from Sketch into Envision so that as we changed things in our design package, we didn't have to then go and pick up those things and upload them into the Envision app. It all just happened as we moved things around. So we found that really useful and really efficient and streamlined. And you know, as we did get feedback, we could make changes almost on the fly and kind of represent them again. Um, so it made it very easy to work with. If you're considering using Envision App, for anyone who needs to present, especially digital work, be able to showcase how it's going to work in real life and, and do all of that remotely, Envision App is a great tool for that job. The only thing I would say is that if you're uh, interested in doing more than that, if, um, for example, you're wanting to collaborate more with your development team, um, or you're looking to you know, share the assets that, that you're using with, with a, a kind of a coding team, um, there are some limitations. And so we found it to be a really useful tool for really quick prototyping. But if we want more advanced prototyping, we found it a little bit restrictive. So really good if you're just getting started, you want to present work to, to clients, you want to get their feedback really quickly and maybe even get some end user feedback. Uh, then Envision Apps are a really simple tool to use and really quick to get started.